Hello Lola's, welcome back to my channel guys. Guys, I am here with baby Memphis. And we're gonna just get him into something. We're gonna figure out what he's gonna put on. Um, if you guys are new to my channel, guys, make sure you are subscribed by clicking the red subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And if you like to follow more photos of my babies so that you can see them more close up, Follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is Miss Serenity underscore Smith. I am primarily a collector, a doll collector of lifelike reborns and silicone babies. I also paint both reborns and silicone babies as well. I often put them up for sale, um, both from my personal collection and babies that I just paint with the intentions to sell. I'm primarily sell on Facebook but I do advertise on Instagram as well. I can be contacted through Facebook Messenger or Instagram Messenger. Um, I do get emails at Smith at yahoo.com however a lot of times those emails are like with a whole bunch of like heebie-jeebie so sometimes I don't get to those um, and I prefer to do business on a platform where I can kind of see who I'm dealing with um, because of the dynamics of the community and the industry and how, you know, just trying to avoid from being scammed, if that makes sense. Anyway, guys, um, Memphis is a baby that I painted and he got a little cold in his eye and I, I need to get it out but I'll get it out later and he is a good sized baby I want to say he is only like maybe three months old but he's a fat little chunky baby and so um he fits clothes really well um he probably could fit some small three to six months but I would probably just keep him in three months or zero to three months still um he has not been rooted yet he will get rooted though and um he is for my personal collection I've worked on him along with many other babies that's just been like a little dab here a little dab there over time and then eventually I finish him up the last baby it, I painted on that baby for a couple months <laughs> off and on um sometimes my friends ask me like so when were you working on that baby it's like you know I can't really answer that question because you know I'll start a baby uh and then I'll just sit it to the side sometimes I lose interest sometimes I get busy with you know um work that I have to finish and you know or Prototypes or projects or well not prototypes not like I do a whole lot of prototypes, but you guys know what I mean Those have that have been some of the reasons why I had stopped anyway All right, so Let's get him changed. Oh, man. What did I do with that diaper? <sighs> yeah, okay. I had decided I would probably try to change him in just an all-white diaper so he has an open mouth, so I didn't give him a magnet. Let me show you guys. Oh, close. So I didn't give him a magnet because of his open mouth, and I could just modify his pacifier. And I don't see the point of wasting a magnet because, for one, the way that his mouth is, is it just, it probably would fit better just to do the mac modified pacifier anyway. Look at him. So, the story behind this baby is that he's a Cassie Brace baby, and I don't typically um, collect Cassie Brace babies, not because I don't like them. Um, I usually love their faces, but I usually think that the feet are too small. But somewhere I saw this baby posted, this sculpt posted, and I saw the feet, and I was like, that one looked like it's actually more proportionate. And I was like, I'm gonna take a chance. So I just ordered it. I said, well, if I don't like it, I'll paint it and sell it. Cause a lot of people love Cassie Bray sculpts. I know some people that only collect Cassie Bray sculpts. So I thought, 
I'm gonna give it a try. And so if I, you know, cause it was something intriguing about the sculpt face and his size and just everything. And so I originally said, I liked him as a girl and this baby actually was, oh, and this baby actually was one that I had, was choosing between being a redhead, believe it or not, um, with Archie. Even though I had the scope already, I was just gonna, you know, have one ordered through the artist. But um, we decided to go with Kai. And so I just kept seeing boy and I was like this is just boy and so yeah and then when I named Archie Archie and I think it was my Bella Blessing said um recommended some names like Denver Dallas Memphis and then I was like oh my god I love Memphis and he just was so a Memphis so that that's how that came about guys um I finally shipped off my last custom baby and I can't tell you how amazing that feels. It felt like I would never get to the end of that list of babies. I had worked with some amazing mommies um, that almost tempted me to think that I could do it again. But I realized guys, as much as I get the request to do custom orders, I just work so much better just being completely pressure free and just where I could just create my own vision, my own thoughts, experiment, I learn, I grow. That's where I grow at when I work on my own. And then, you know, if I decide to sell it, I can sell it. But I don't grow when I have a, you know, a projected target to, you know, meet or a look that the mommy is wanting me to to accomplish I can't grow from that you know because I have to try to be very careful and da 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 so yeah so um oh also guys today is the last day if you want to enter the Warren giveaway you do have to purchase your Warren sculpt by Laura Tudor Ross from her website, My World of Babies, directly from her. Message me, let me know that you've you've ordered um, from her. And I will put your name on the list. I am gonna draw names. I'm not gonna draw names today. I'm gonna draw names tomorrow just because I wanna give everybody until midnight to enter and order. So um, if you haven't ordered your kit and how it's going to work, if I get at least 20 people, and I've gotten quite a bit, so I'm almost there, but if not, it's just going to be a cuddle baby. So either if I get 20, um, I'm going, if I, if I get 20 people to buy that kit, I am going to do paint, pull a name and I will paint one of whoever name I pull, I will paint their kit for them for free they will be responsible for their own shipping um and then if um i don't get 20 people i said at least 15 i may waver on that but i will do a whoever name i pull i will do a cuddle baby um which is the delia scrub is what i'm working on actually and i will um complete that baby as a cuddle baby and that will be the winning baby now I tend to like him in blues so I wanted to try I already know he looks good in this so and I have the matching hat and stuff for that but I like him in this and I know it's it's hot here but it's so cold in my house because of we you know keeping it Cool. Oh, let me take his hat off. He's he's cute, even bald. This is him bald, guys. Um, he does not just FYI. He doesn't have, believe it or not, he doesn't have any scratches. I didn't give him any scratches. I don't think. I didn't give him any scratches, but he does have 
quite a bit of mottling. Um, he have a little veining, barely. And um, so he has nicely done nails and these just have really cute coloring, I think. And, but yeah, his, I just did more modeling and stuff on him and focus on his coloring. Um, I know a lot of people were saying he was close to my color. So this is him in my arms. I think I am a little bit lighter than him in person, but, um, my arms are darker because I get more sun on my arms and stuff. But as you can see up here, I'm much lighter. My face is lighter. Um, and I guess, anyway, I'm not going to tell that. But yeah, so, so yeah, he is, he is very much blended though with me. So, all right. Let's see what you look like in this. I don't like him in this color. Believe it or not, I hate that hat on him. I don't know, it just throws his skin tone off. So, I think he will be adorable in this. This is pretty big. This is a three to six months Jamboree. I think I got this from Jamboree years ago. So, I do like him in neutral colors. Um, he does have clothes because I was shopping for him actually i was shopping for him to be a girl at first and then i was shopping then he i started to shop for him as a boy so this baby been a thought for a while so yeah so anyway so he, i think he's cute in this i gotta hurry up and just have like this cute little pocket on the back let's see so yeah, I think he'll be really cute in this little this little number. So maybe I will put him on, let him keep this on. Versus, I was gonna put him on the um. I was actually gonna put him on that bright colors with his socks and his shoes. I got him little hot tops and stuff to put on. But he's so little. Well, not little, but he's not no walking baby. So I can put him on. <laughs> oh my gosh. I could put him on this hat, which I love this color on him. Or I brought him this, which is more closer to what he has on. Kind of like almost like a jean blue. And I do like this color blue on him. So, my little sweetie. He gonna be a cute winter baby too. And these are his little footsies. I love his footsies. I don't know. So, so yeah, I actually love him. I actually spent, I got him dressed last night before I went to bed and I actually, sat here before I started the video and just started, just held him for a little while, which that's usually a good sign because he's like a real cuddle baby. Um, a lot of people like to say that, you know, silicone babies are more cuddly and stuff like that. You know, I'm not really certain on that. I think it depends on how you weight the baby, how the baby flows. Cause sometimes no matter how you, how good you weight them, the sculpting just makes it more stiff or something but anyway i rooted his eye eyelashes and his eyebrows i actually love the way I, his eyebrows came out i painted his eyebrows and they were they came out really really nice in person and so he has like a like a different type of texture i did do a different type of texture but his little nose is so cute and yeah so he's not like textured like my other babies quite so i think he does kind of a little bit like aspen but yeah but he's 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 just i don't know something about him i just love him so i hope you guys love him with me and i can't wait to do lots more videos with him oh and we gotta find his daddy 
you know that's always the 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 tea right there is who is this baby daddy who is your daddy huh yeah so yeah so that is that is my little guy all right guys thanks for watching i am going to go get myself together i am oh real quick sorry i this week my whole schedule got thrown off and i'm gonna have to start next week with the series and all the other videos that i have planned for you guys okay all right talk to you guys later bye bye